right, so today is going to be a combination of two, which is going to be a cum shot with me and Poundland in the beginning of the video, or after my intro, obviously. And afterwards, I'm going to bring you guys a haul of, oh my goodness, the stuff that I got. I lot, got a lot of 50p stuff, like, because there's a sell on, and, like, just, I got really, really good stuff um, this week. So, yeah, let's get on to the cum shot with me video, and then I'll come back and do um, the whole video. having a um i can say it's a nationwide sale so th there's a guarantee that well there's yeah well, no, that's a guarantee there's a chance basically that your poundland store is having a sale and especially in the toy section which i have been noticing is been like sort of nationwide with like other poundland hauls i've been watching and this i grabbed for two pounds and it's the star wars a force awakens play set so i like seriously i saw this there was a bunch of them there not really people are paying attention to them but you can't really say that because like you have it has to be a certain period certain time and a certain day like give people weekend it's not going to be there anymore but like there was a whole bunch of these and like different characters um in poundland and i was like so surprised to see it the kids are a star wars fan but not really fan 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 like they like it but not they're fan 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 I definitely know they will play with this. But I've got to, uh, by the way, I've got to apologise. Sometimes I'm going to open the curtains and close it because the sun right now, I'm not going to, listen, I'm not going to like be like, oh my goodness, the sun is disturbing me film my video. I went out yesterday. It was such a sunny day. It felt good, okay? It, it, seriously, the sun made my day. So I went out and there was a sunny day and I was like, oh, this is nice. And I went to Poundland and I grabbed bargains and I was like, oh my goodness, my day is just fantastic. Next thing I got is this vase. I think you could call it a vase. I think you could call it a vase, basically. I'm going to call it a vase, but it says 
you you oh i'm not gonna bother reading that but like i'm calling a bus this was 50p um it's been it's there's a ton of them in pound nine for a very very long time now and like they got reduced to 50p right and like i saw this i put it down because i was like where, where am i gonna pull it and then i went to sainsbury's and when i was walking into sainsbury's i was like i'm gonna go back for that bus i know where i'm gonna pull it I'm gonna put it on my daughter's window and I'm gonna get a pink flower from Poundland and um, I think yeah one pink flower and put it in here but I did get a flower as well from Poundland but and like, I I don't know about you but I feel like should, is that, oh, I don't know but anyways if I I'm gonna reduce this it's too long um, but I for some reason I just felt like this red flower would go very well in here but the thing in my daughter's room is pink, so it's, it'll be just, like, I need to get a pink flower, basically. Pink or, yeah, pink or white flower. Another vase I picked up for 50p, and this I actually, gonna, it's gonna go in the kitchen with this flower. I mean, you can see the combination, that this goes well. In the kitchen, the theme is red, like, same as here, this background. The theme is red, and, like, I thought this could be, like, a really nice vase to go in the, dining table in the kitchen because the dining table is black i just felt like this like vase and the red rose like they're i feel like they're really i feel like black red and gray are a good combination of colors together and i feel like, i seriously feel like this is gonna look really really pretty and like this vase i know you used to pay attention to it but like you know when something gets reduced and you're like oh you're like you know what you're not bad next i got this now this is a What's it yet? Oh, I forgot. It's a tea light holder, but I'm not gonna use it as a tea light holder. I have this exact one, but in blue, in the bathroom. I use it to store, um, I use it to store as toothbrushes. My voice is going. <clears throat> <clears throat> I don't know why. But I'm gonna use this to store some of my makeup brushes. I feel like it's gonna look really, really nice here, I think. I'm gonna put makeup brushes that I grab on a frequent basis over here, just to decorate the area. I think I'm, yeah, I'm considering redecorating this area. So it's gonna go here. It's a really, really nice big shade, and like the design on it, really, really nice. And I like like at the bottom here, this like on a bubble design. But like, yeah, really nice. I just say there are more 50p stuff that I got from Poundland. They are coming up. But books wise books wise i don't know if you can say that i'm saying it but books wise i got this um i got two books yeah the, one of the first books is i we already have one of these um like googly eye there you go we googly eye books but um we saw this one and like my son was like this one and we have to have it the i'm a police officer googly eyed um book they've got like a ton of these in poundland it's like it's worth buying to be honest the color it's very bright i say it's probably like level four maybe level four reading maybe next is this book it's called this old thing and it's by dawn o porter now this was a channel four series i watched i think it was back in 2000 i think it was over 2015 yeah i think it was 2015 and i watched it i watched it to the point where the like the finished the series was finished but it was still available on demand and at the point I was, I was enjoying it so much that I was watching like the same episodes again and again and it wasn't available anymore and it's basically just all about how you can fall in love with vintage clothes it's like every single week every episode they would um, find like they had like a member of the public not that they would pick them randomly on the street but it was just they had someone who wasn't really a vintage, think, fashion, vintage lover and try and convince them like vintage fashion I just basically love this series and the book basically the book is all about night, um, um, fashion back in the 20s, 30s um, and like yeah and like basically it's got some sewing tips as well i like to sew i have a sewing machine downstairs i haven't used that sewing machine in such a long time but it's just one of those things it's always in the back of my head like you need to go back to sewing i swear i was like oh my goodness i was talking so loud everyone in the store could hear me i'm very sure they could hear me next um again 50p bargain the exotic mango scented pot puri and they're like flower scented flowers basically and like 
yeah that's what i can say it smells nice my son just woke up so i'm gonna have to film this video while holding it but it's doable yeah this one so we got a london bus i saw this and i was like oh london bus let's grab this we don't have a bus we, we don't have a bus toy but it was re it's really really nice it's like it's nice and pacific oh next i saw these and i was like i have to grab this and it's the marvels yeah it is marvels isn't it it's like the Marvel comic like heroes. So full Spider-Man and all of those, and Iron Man and that. And it's like um, some colouring pens, basically. And also the cover, this bit, is a sharpener. I was like, oh my goodness. This is nice. 50p bargains. I picked up this um, spice rack. The back, it's got like these hooks. You could say they're hooks, right? I think they're hooks, I think you call them that. Um, you, these hooks where you can like um, hang them up on the wall. And like, I'm not gonna use them as spice racks. And like, I feel like this, I could use this in the toilet to store like um, cleaning products. Like really, really like cleaning products, not too heavy. So I got actually two, one for each bathroom. And like, I just felt like this is like nice. Like, and I'm gonna color, I'm gonna paint them white. Yeah, I'm gonna paint them white and then I'm gonna hang up in like um, hang one in each toilet. So, another thing um, for sale is this um, nightcap mixer glasses. This is not actually for me, but this was 50p. It's like relatives back home in Africa. I'm decluttering all of like my cups and some of my glasses, and like I thought this is 50p, but let's not why not like add that into their delivery package that I'm going to send very soon so if I go back to the store and I see more I am going to get more for them back home they said they wanted more cutlery um, stuff and I thought well if they want more cutlery they're not going to not want like glasses and cups so next I got this welcome home sign and this actually you can hang it up and I thought this this and by the way again this was a 50p bargain this I thought I could DIY it and then like i've got a place in my um hallway that i can hand this up but i was like i saw this and at one point i was like let me just pull it down okay now you're just picking things up because it's 50p where are you gonna put it and i was like you know what i could diy it literally in the stores i was like i can diy this and like yeah i've got i've got an idea in mind i feel like it's gonna look so good and i'll bring you guys a video obviously at the end i will give you guys information on how you guys can win um the Gigi hadid makeup palette that i promised that i would give away so the stuff i've got in the makeup department are the rimmel london blusher but like um this is a really cream blush i've tried it on a little bit i opened it up because i was like okay i got it for a pound but you know it's it's rimmel london is this gonna suit me yeah it, it kind of suits it's not too harsh on my face um the other thing i got is the revlon eyeliner pencil and like i just love like green shades like this so i had to grab it it'd be great like under the eye type of makeup so those are the two items that i got in like the makeup department 50p as well i got an ice cream scoop this is the ice cream scoop i don't know can you see you can see the metal thing moving right yeah i was like oh my goodness this is gonna be good it's that 50p ice cream scoop there was like a bunch of them just sitting there i also got two doorknobs um in a pack and like this was 50p as well i've always seen these doorknobs no one pays attention to them but like it was 50p if i color my wardrobe again i will add these doorknobs for 50p i picked up a pack of skittles these were like in the christmas time yeah they were in the christmas time they were selling these for one pound but i picked it up for 50p this is a diy compartment organizer to basically to store all the screws i told you like in my last this month's um poundland haul on the first of april i said that i got a toolbox well this i want to get this i saw was that like, you can like put all the screws in here the toolbox can be for like um are they called screws <laughs> basically like to separate like put all the screws and wall plugs in here and I like it because um, you can actually, um, if you wanted to separate some of like the um, screws and stuff that you're going to put inside, you've, they've got like these things and you can actually add like 
you know, make your own separation of stuff and like, yeah, I, it's really, really nice for one pound though. And it's nice and big as well. I got um, double ended felt tip pens, a 16 pack. My son's been asking me for this. It's time to go and give him. So let me go and give him. I think they're double ended because one, one, end, one end is thicker than the other. Yes, yes. So the, the size of each end is different. That's why it's double-ended. Nice. The sun is still out, but it's like dimmed down a little bit, but it's still like beautiful to go outside. I'm enjoying this weather. I still think it's fabulous that it's been cold lately. But next is this. It's, um, what you call this? Apron. <laughs> I know it's really bad, but I I don't, I don't know. Originally there was this vintage apron I was gonna get in Palmland. I don't know if it's still there. Um, I probably won't get it because I already, you know, you can have two aprons. You can have two aprons. But um, I got a cooking apron. They were basically they were selling at fifty p at like the sales section right in front of the store, as I was telling you. And like I saw this, I thought it's gonna come out a bit short. It is proper like apron, good apron size. Really nice. When if I go into the store and it's still there, I might get the black one as well and the vintage one as well. I also got, a, for 50p as well, I got a tea towel. Now this tea towel says, I think these pans need to be left to soak. Also known as, I don't feel like filling the dishes up right now. Ugh. Who's gonna say no to like tea towels that are 50p? They're essential. Like, no one's gonna say no to that, you know? You see it, grab it, more tea towels for you. So that was it for the haul, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I am giving away the Gigi Hadid um, eyeshadow palette. And basically, the reason why I'm giving it away because um, I mentioned in like a vlog a couple of weeks ago, I'll link it up here, um, that I got my first YouTube paycheck. Obviously, most of us have been demonetized and obviously you'll look at my subscribers and you think, well, how, well hold up, what are you saying? No, um, basically it was just money I made before we, before some of us got demonetized. It came through after the demonetization and I said that honestly like, I, I've only made this money because a lot of you guys watched and subscribed to the channel and I thought well, why not do a giveaway? So I'm giving away the Gigi Hadid palette. If you want to win, all you have to do is go in the description box and you have to be subscribed to the channel and also do is go in the description box and just say, I want to enter into the giveaway. Just say, I want to enter into the giveaway. And um, basically, that is basically it. By the end of next week, um, I will choose a winner. But like, it'll be really, really handy. You just like, maybe just create an email so that I can just contact you so that you can send me address and then so that I can send the winner that she had palette and as I was saying before I'm doing it because a lot of you guys have been showing me a lot of support in the past couple of months and I really do appreciate every single one of you guys who subscribes to the channel and take care of yourselves guys I will see you guys next time and yeah take care bye